Today during Hurricane Preparedness Week, we're talking about insurance and about getting an insurance checkup. We're joined by Roland Tabria with the DCCA Insurance Division. Roland, thanks for joining us. Well, thanks, John, for having the Insurance Division. Welcome to Safe Haven Talk. Yeah. Well, I, th I think when people think about insurance, they don't consider hurricanes and flash flooding um, as separate policies. Can you talk a little bit about the need for that? Yeah, um, a lot of policies. There is no one standard type of policy. Some cover, um, your typical homeowners will cover perils like windstorm, not hurricane windstorm, but just windstorm, high winds, and fire. You might also have separate policies or endorsements that cover hurricane coverage specifically and flood or even earthquake. Those will typically be endorsements or, again, a standalone policy. But you really have to read or understand your own policy to understand that. As we go into hurricane season coming up, uh, is there anything people should do regarding their insurance policies? Or yeah, definitely. We we recommend that people you know review your insurance policy, especially your coverage limits. Um, you know, if you've had any like a lot of homes in Boy have photovoltaic or even had an extension, you know, remodeling or extension to have another family member live in your house. If anything like that happens, your coverage limits might be completely inadequate. So we often recommend that people look at their policies to see if their policy, policy still covers what they have, what they own, and what they have. Even contents, you know, did, did your house, what you have in your house, did it completely grow? Or, you know, so really look at what you have in your policy, as well as what it doesn't cover. You know, again, um, does it cover flood? Does it cover hurricane? Or is that a completely separate policy? And especially, how is your um, how is your limits value? You know, we have typically things called replacement costs. So, if something gets damaged, the insurance will cover to replace that entire item. But if it's uh, valued at what we call actual cash value, that includes depreciation or that takes into account depreciation. So you might get far less. So look and understand policy covers and how it covers it. And if you have any questions or even trying to understand how to value your um, policy, we recommend contacting your uh, licensed insurance agent or professional to really help you assist you with that. Because it's really a, a, um, a individual um, situation. You know, each, each individual situation is different. So. Right, and, yeah, each policy is different. And so that's good advice. Uh, as we head into hurricane season, Check in with your agent to review your policies and make sure you have adequate coverage for your current situation and the current hazards you might face. Thanks for watching.